this is Jenny and Rebecca, and we are going to teach you Silent Night. Silent Night is a beautiful song. It is in 3-4 time, and what that means is there's three beats in every measure, instead of what we're used to, four. So you're going to go one, two, three, one, two, three, for the simplest pattern that you have. And let's just maybe sing the first line of it. It's going to be rather high in pitch, so if you want to drop an octave, I might, your voice. Yeah, we'll see. We're just going to sing Silent Night, okay. Holy Night, All is Calm, All is Bright. That's it. Okay. And the chords are C, we switch to G7, then we switch back to C. So this is the simplest strum of just one, two, three, one, two, three. One, it's two, all down. Yeah. And just emphasize every third strum. The first of every third. Right. One, two, go. Silent A 3-4 strum can be more interesting than that, so one of the ones that we use a lot is 1, 2, and 3, 1, 2, and 3, 1, 2, and 3, and that's going to be down, down, up, down, then you do it again, down, down, up, down, 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 up, down. Let's try that without any okay. chords, just because sometimes the feeling of the 3 is tricky. Yeah. Okay, here we go, 1, 2, 3, down. One on B3, is that lighter than the one on down? Bit. Yeah, it looks like you don't go quite so far with your hand. Because it's not a strong beat. Well, it also makes it easier to go down again if you don't put your hand so far down. I've never thought of that, but you're right. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> so let's try the first line of Silent Night with that strum. And we're okay. still going to only go up to the bright part. No <laughs> okay. okay, here we go. And here's a note. One, two, and three. Silent Night. was originally composed by Franz Gruber. He was a monk. He was in a church where it flooded a lot. It was on a river. <laughs> and so he went there one Christmas Eve all ready to practice his music and do the service and darn it, the organ was broken. <laughs> no, that's true. So he also played the guitar and he was like, "How? what am I going to do? And he composed this song. And for a long time, people throughout Europe call it the song from heaven since it was so beautiful. But uh, it, he later took credit for the song, but he was a classical guitarist, and I know a tiny weeny bit about classical guitar, not much, but enough to apply to ukulele. So I'm going to take these two fingers only on my right hand. I'm going to put my thumb, kind of, my, I mean my pinky. Kind of, like so, this is your no, thumb. my okay. thumb so it's kind of balanced on the uke. Your pinky. My pinky, yes. There we go. And okay. I'm going to go. Uh, it has to be three beats, so I'm going to go one. And, so I'm going uh, out, out, in, 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 out. You mean out. the outer strings and then inner strings? That's what and you're the problem with the three four is that you have to do the inner strings twice. Twice. So you have to go out, we're doing out, in, 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 in. We're doing out. two strings per beat. Correct. You want to try? I'll do a measure. You do a measure. Okay. Pat. line now and I'll show you how pretty Silent Night can sound with this. And then we're going to do a kind of duet, make it so her part's not quite as hard. <laughs> so we're going to both pluck that? No, I, I have another plan. No, I mean right now what are we doing? You're listening and I'm... Okay, playing. good. All right, I can do that.
gorgeous sun. 